Let's learn to find out the prime numbers from 100 to 200. As a first step, we will list down the first six prime numbers. 2, 3, 5, 7, 11 and 13. What we will be doing is we'll mark all the multiples of these six numbers as the composite numbers and then all the unmarked numbers will be the prime numbers. Let's first start with 2. All the even numbers in our table are multiples of 2. So, they will be marked as composite numbers. Next, number 3. This row and this row has all the multiples of 3. So, we will mark these numbers also as composite numbers. Next, we can see that the multiples of 5 are arranged like this. So, we will mark them as composite numbers. In a similar manner, the multiples of 7 are arranged like this. We will mark these numbers also as composite numbers. Now, let's handle the multiples of 11 and 13 in a slightly different manner. The multiples of 11 in this table are shown here. Out of these, only 3 numbers 121, 143 and 187 are unmarked. So, we will be marking these multiples as composite numbers. Finally, we will consider number 13. The multiples of 13 between 100 and 200 are listed here. Out of these, only 169 is an unmarked number. So, we'll mark 169 as a composite number. Now, the next prime number in our list would be 17 and the multiples of 17 between 100 and 200 are listed here. If you note carefully, all these multiples are already marked as composite numbers. So, we can stop here and mark all the remaining unmarked numbers as prime numbers. In total, we have 21 prime numbers between 100 and 200. 